Step in the box, baseball fans. Welcome back to another episode. We've got a recap of 40 blaster boxes, a sealed case of 2023 Top Series 1. We redeemed these for the Natty Packs, the National Packs. It was four blasters for one. We got these for $15 a piece, so it was $60 to get one Natty Pack. I would highly caution you, do not buy blaster boxes of Series 1. We've now opened 88 blasters of Series 1, even though this was case was better. Stick around to the end. It was better than the first case. But it's tough sledding, man. Let's start with Otani. I mean, is he going to be MVP? Some people are starting to question that. Uh, let's see how many of these we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We got ten of those. We'll kind of cross check those with some of the rookies. Here's the uh, stars, of the MLB paper. I like this card right here. I'd love to get this autograph. That'd be a cool one. Otani and Reed Detmers. Reed Detmers with the no hitter, and he's from uh, Illinois. We had two of the chromes. And then one relic. We did not get an Otani relic in the uh, first case. So there's the Otanis. We'll move those over there. And then trout. Let's see how many trouts we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So pretty consistent. You'll see that this case, you can uh, sort out singles and kind of get a good idea of what the run was like. Same thing with this paper here. And then I top load some of the better ones that sell for a buck or two. 30 for 30 club and the chrome, one of those. So there's the trout. I always put any insert Ken Griffey Jr., the kid, in a top loader, buck or two there. So there's that. Let's go to, I'm not going to go through all these, but this is what I do. You get a good idea what I do. I go through, and I just numbered these for this time, but like, I put all the Adlays in a pile. So there was 12 of those. Here's Gunner. There was 12 of those. 13 of Riley Green. So there was anywhere between 10 to 13 of these rookies. I was pulling... Casas, 13. Um, the Harris was a little weird because I think I skipped some. He was in a weird spot. 10 on Morrell. Uh, Harris kind of looked like Ozzy Albies, and I was going through. So I'll go through the base. Nolan Gorman, there was 12. Oswaldo Peraza, 9. I bet you I missed one of those. So it's pretty safe to say, in my opinion, that we could put together 10 complete sets if we were really trying I'm not going to try with Series 1, I'll tell you that right now. I just wanted to pull the good rookies, or well, what I consider the good rookies. And then here's some more rookie stuff that I was putting aside. The Adlai, Stars MLB, got a bunch of those. Riley Green, Nolan Gorman, those are the three rookies in that. The inserts of the 88 set, sleeve all those as well. And then I top-loaded these, because these are tough pulls. Gunner, Adlai. Beatty, Riley Green, and then the Chromes. You don't get very many of those. So I was top-loading those as well. So there's a bunch of the rookie stuff. Bunch of the rookie stuff. Um, just going to quickly fly by. I sleeved all the blues. I like sleeving the parallels. There's that. I like this insert set. I just sorted them out quick. Kind of get an idea of the stacks that I put stuff in. I'm going to co-op these. Here's the Rainbow Foils non-rookies. One-two punch. I pulled that uh, Otani and Reed Detmers card. Forgot what they're calling this. Welcome to the club. Most of them are 30 for 30, but 20 for 20. Some of these 40 for 40. So there's all those. And then you could even probably top load some of these. I know Ronald Acuna Jr. is in here. The Judge, the Jury, the Executioner. Some Wanders, some Bobby Witts. There's a bunch of them. I don't do that. But again, sorted those out. And then I sleeve all the chromes. 
Probably could put together this set after opening up 88 boxes. Again, non-rookies and not Otani, not Trout. Probably could try to sell some of these, like Soto, Acuna, Bobby Witt, Bryce Harper. I don't know, buck or two on the chromes. And then, again, I'm not going to waste the time. But this is the Stars, the MLB paper. They need to get rid of that set next year. Please do something different. That thing's getting old. Home run challenge cards. Interesting. I counted these up. There's 31, and we had 31 in the other case as well. But that was with eight extra boxes. I really wish I would have videotaped this case. I didn't want to bore you guys with that many packs, considering that first case was so bad. So I just decided to rip tonight and then organize. End up being a decent case. A couple nice pulls you're going to see in a second. Hang around to the end. Um, won't go through all these relics, but again, 40 relics. The first case also had a black and a blue. Nothing lower. And then the rest were base. Add like a couple rookies and then put a few of the better players on the top. Mookie here. And then everybody else. So, relics. You get a couple piece for those. Off each box. I paid 15 a box. Get it down to 13 a box. And here we go. The main event. This is why we opened them. Let's see what we pulled. This is all the top load card. Not all of it's good. I'll tell you that right now, but. I like the heavy top load, guys. I top load every Aces. I should be able to put together this set after we're done now, after opening 88 Blasters. Randy, Julio Arias, Max Freed, Rodon, Nolan Ryan, Nola Cole, Scherzer, Alcantara, double down on him, Cease, Greg Maddox, Bob Gibson, Corbin Burns, Verlander double down on him. So nice little spread of cards there. Just making sure we don't have any blues or golds. And then here comes the rainbow foils. Wander rainbow foil. Michael Grove rookie. Again, I sleep every rainbow foil rookie. Mark Apple, David Villar. Ivan Herrera for the Cardinals, Derek Hall. And here is Marcus Wilson. I think we got him in case one, too. Uh, let's go to the Blues. Man, the Blues look nice. By far the best blue, in my opinion. Michael Harris, rookie. Also got the Bobby Witt Cup. That looks pretty nice. Future star CJ Abrams. Steel Walker. Zach Thompson. Um, and a couple of the better veterans. Bryce Harper, Juan Soto, veterans, a.k.a. superstars. So there's that. And then let's get down to the nitty-gritty. Jacob deGrom, that was a blue-black aces. Blue parallel. We had one of those in each case. It's interesting when you go through case by case, you can really compare to what comes out. So you can expect a blue relic, a numbered relic, a blue one of these, we had two golds in the first case, one in the second case, Tanner Rainey. We had uh, one numbered card, or one of these foils in the first case. We got two this case. Jordan Lyles and Jacob DeGrom. That Jacob DeGrom's pretty cool. $299, and Lyles was $499. And then we went back to back jacks on the Shohei Otani oh, Aces card. It's a nice card. I did not look up the value of this. I'm guessing this is probably still 20 to 30 bucks. I might even grade these. We had a Mother's Day, Tyler Stevenson. The next card, as you can see, is black. These were supposed to be Hobby Box exclusive. We once again got a black and a blaster. We got a black the first time. Um, I believe we got a Mother's Day the first time, too. And there you go, Nathaniel Lowe, Nate Lowe, black. That is out of 72. 
We got a Golden Mirror SSP of Marcel Azuna with a basket of peaches. The Georgia Peach. SSP Marcel Azuna. Cool card. And then the big hit, the case hit. By far the best card in both cases. Home field advantage, Adley Rutschman. The big dog. So, again, I kind of wish I would open this case on camera. It was way better. I mean, you figure one big hit every 10 boxes. Not good by any means. SSP, Golden Mirror, HFA, Black, and uh, Mother's Day. And then, again, these Aces cards are pretty sweet. The Otani. Not a bad case overall. Again, I would not recommend you getting a case of Blasters of Series 1 from 2023. Until they're 10 bucks a piece or less. Like, seriously, I think that is the number. If you can get Blasters for $10 a piece, it might be worth it. But even at 15 if I didn't get those Silver Packs, Daddy Packs from... The National, this would be total bust, even with some of these hits. But overall, not a bad case. A lot of fun. Again, I didn't want to bore you guys with the uh, three hours of opening 280 packs. Hope you guys enjoyed the, uh, the recap here. We're almost to 7,000 subscribers. If you're new, we open a lot of flagship. Series 1, Series 2, uh, Update Series. Tops Chrome, Bowman, Sapphire of all those, you name it. We're going to be opening up some Tops Chrome Blasters next week, probably late next week, and some 2022 Chrome Anniversary, the Platinum Anniversary. It's called Platinum, not Anniversary. But hope you guys enjoyed that. Please like, subscribe, share, comment below. Until next time, peace.